Welcome to Sky Sea Channel, the channel that always discusses anything about the sea. Today we have a mind-blowing video for you. You won't believe how much this ship costs. It's not a yacht, it's not a cruise ship, it's not even a submarine. It's a massive, powerful, and awe-inspiring aircraft carrier, and it's the pride of the US Navy. It's called the USS Gerald R. Ford, and it cost a whopping $12 billion to build, and another $6.5 billion for the aircraft on board. That's a total of $18.5 billion for one ship. That's more than the GDP of some countries like Iceland or Jamaica. Why is it so expensive? What makes it so special? And what challenges and controversies does it face? You're about to find out in this video. Imagine a ship that can carry more than 75 planes, launch them faster and farther than ever before, and track and target multiple enemies at once. Now imagine that this ship costs more than the GDP of some countries. This is the USS Gerald R. Ford, the most expensive ship ever built. In this video, we'll show you why this ship is worth every penny, and what challenges and controversies it faces. But what makes this ship so amazing? Well, let me tell you. The USS Gerald R. Ford is the lead ship of its class of nuclear-powered aircraft carriers. It was named after the 38th President of the United States, Gerald Ford, who served in the Navy during World War II. Fun Fact Gerald Ford was almost killed by a typhoon while serving on board another aircraft carrier, but he survived by clinging to a lifeline. The USS Gerald R. Ford was commissioned in 2017, and replaced the USS Enterprise, which was decommissioned in 2012 after 51 years of service. The USS Gerald R. Ford is the largest warship ever constructed, measuring 1,092 feet long and 256 feet wide. That's about three football fields long and eight lanes wide. It can carry more than 75 aircraft, including F-35 fighters, E-2D Hawkeyes, and MQ-25 Stingrays. It has a crew of about 4,500 brave and dedicated sailors and officers who work tirelessly to keep this ship running smoothly. The USS Gerald R. Ford is designed to be more efficient, more powerful, and more advanced than any other carrier in the world. It has two nuclear reactors that provide enough energy to power a city of 100,000 people. It has an electromagnetic catapult system that can launch planes faster and farther than steam catapults. How fast? Well, imagine going from 0 to 160 miles per hour in less than 2 seconds. That's how fast these planes take off. For example, in 2019, this system successfully launched an F-A-18 Super Hornet with a 1,000-pound bomb attached to it. It has an advanced arresting gear system that can recover planes more safely and smoothly than hydraulic systems. How smooth? Well, imagine landing on a moving runway that's only 300 feet long. That's how smooth these planes land. It has a dual-band radar that can track and target multiple threats simultaneously. How many? Well. Imagine being able to see and shoot at hundreds of enemies in the air, on the sea, and on the land. That's how many this radar can handle. It has a reduced radar signature that makes it harder to detect by enemies. How hard? Well, imagine trying to find a needle in a haystack. That's how hard this ship is to spot. But that's not all. There's more. The USS Gerald R. Ford is also designed to be more adaptable and flexible than previous carriers. It has a larger flight deck that can accommodate more aircraft and different configurations. It has more weapon storage and more elevators to move them faster. It has more automation and digital systems that reduce manpower and maintenance costs. It has more survivability features that protect it from damage and fire. The USS Gerald R. Ford is expected to serve for at least 50 years, and will be the flagship of the U.S. Navy's carrier strike groups. It will be able to project power and influence around the world, and support various missions such as humanitarian aid, disaster relief, deterrence, and combat operations. The USS Gerald R. Ford is truly an impressive ship, but it also comes with some challenges and controversies. The ship has faced several delays and cost overruns due to technical issues and design changes. 
Some of the new technologies have not been fully tested or proven in operational conditions. Some critics have questioned the need for such an expensive and complex ship in an era of anti-ship missiles and cyber attacks. For instance, in 2018, a Chinese hacker group called APT-10 allegedly breached the networks of several U.S. Navy contractors and stole sensitive information about the USS Gerald R. Ford. What do you think of the USS Gerald R. Ford? Do you think it's worth the price tag? Do you think it's a game changer for naval warfare? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching Sky Sea Channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos about anything related to the sea. See you next time.